seriously? <laughs> Bad Woman trailer. Wow, the balls it takes to greenlight a project like that when we are just on the roller coaster of Get Woke Go Broke. This shit is getting rejected by the mainstream. By the way, the mainstream, fairly liberal these days. But fairly liberal does not mean progressive tumbler tard. Uh, so folks, you want to make a Batwoman show? Fine. Go ahead. Doesn't make me mad. You're going to do Barbara Gordon, uh, Cassandra Kane, uh, who's like the two or three girls who played Robin. You could pick one out of the hat, whatever fits the actress. You're going to shoehorn into the fucking position. Okay, fine. Oh, wait, no, you're doing some random chick who's the, the cousin of Bruce Wayne. It's a little Mary Sue-ish, but uh, okay. So who is she? Oh, Negasonic Teenage Bulldike. Okay. I can ignore this, I guess. I mean, the whole world would probably love a Batman t TV show. The whole world could probably handle a Batwoman TV show. But this is neither of those things. This is a Mary Sue feminist insert who is not here to participate in the Batman mythos. She's not here to be a part of the Batman mythos. And since the, uh, of course, the main female uh, candidates in the canon to be a Batwoman are straight and obviously, look, this is slightly off topic, but I can count on two hands the number of times I've been watching HBO and they're going, here's a new show about a lesbian in a man's world uh, showing that lesbian women can be strong. Okay, next uh, trailer for new show. A oh, Watchmen, that looks pretty good. I fucking love The Watchmen. Uh, next show, lesbian women who's in a man's world. Okay, next show, lesbian women. Are, are you just like plagiarizing yourself at this point? Look, fucking... You wouldn't believe how fast lesbian women, le lesbian women power has gotten past fucking A. Pass A, it's, it's already a dead meme. Because you got roughly four or five dozen shows rushing out to be a part of the wave of women lesbian power. It's not enough just to be a powerful women. You have to be a powerful lesbian women. But wait, there's more. So not only do we have an obvious Negasonic Teenage Warhead ripoff, lesbian women. Uh, I watched the trailer. Now, I haven't looked into this. Somebody told me that this person who is the lesbian women uh, character, the the actress playing, is, is a trans actor, actress even. I, I don't know if that's true, but if so, holy shit, the progressive stack points are off the chart. C -c -c Combo, multi-kill, holy sheep shit. Okay, wh where else were we? Okay, so, cousin of Bruce Wayne, lesbian, possibly trans acted, don't care about that part, so let's stick with the Mary Sue, Bruce Wayne's cousin, lesbian, breaks right into the Batcave somewhere. Uh, Alfred, by the way, is now Damon Wayne's, or I don't know who the fuck that black guy is, but he wishes he was Damon Wayne's. So, nothing original so far. <laughs> that suit is literal perfection, he says about the bat suit. It will be when it fits... Well, if she's an arrogant bitch, she could say if it fits me. But obviously... She's a Mary Sue. She's not a real character. She's there to jerk off the feminists. So it's not it's not a perfect suit when it fits me. It's a perfect suit when it fits a woman. Golf clap, golf clap. Everybody clapped. Thank you, Albert Einstein. You freed the slaves. Jesus fucking Christ. Are you kidding me? with this shit. So, even the main villain, 
whoever this random blonde chick who's fighting a Batwoman in a tiny ass apartment with a fucking stick. I don't know what the fuck that action scene was. That fucking suit looks terrible on her. It looks like it's modeled after the Michelle Pfeiffer Catwoman suit, which rocked because Michelle Pfeiffer and Tim Burton, people with actually talent, are making that. So the music that's playing in this trailer is just shrill, ear-piercing, gay hipster r and I don't know what the fuck it is. Trash trailer music. All trailer music is trash, but this was exceptional. Exceptional dumpster fire quality. Beautiful. Uh, I hate literally everything about this. Um, I have friends who are more into the DC scene than I am. I am a big Batman fan, so I, you know, but like from my childhood, like Batman the anime, Animated Series, all the feature films, not just the Nolan verse. I'm a 30 year old boomer, so we go all the way back to 89, folks. Uh, straight through um, to Returns Forever, even Batman and Robin, uh, and a number of bad cartoon series, <sighs> and some bad comic runs. But here's the point, folks. If you take nothing else away from this video, you need to hear me now. Feminists do not participate in anything. Feminists are not here to be represented. Remember when I said all progressives do is lie 100% of the time, no fucking exceptions. This is not about representation. This is not about inclusion. And this is not about participation. This is like every single solitary feminist Mary Sue character. This is about hostile takeover. It's not enough to be Batwoman. She literally has to take Batman's suit, mold it to her own shape, and become Batwoman. And the only reason why she's not calling herself Batman is because of the pronoun. See, we already have done this in the Marvel verse with Thor, where a female character not only takes Thor's position, not only takes Thor's weapon, not only takes Thor's uniform, she literally takes his fucking birth name. Thor is not a title, it is a fucking name. They are not here to participate. They're not here to be included. They're not here to join. They are here to take your shit from you, destroy it, and then laugh at you. This is a vicious act of hatred. This is not for the empowerment of women. It's not for the empowerment of lesbians. It's not for the empowerment of trans people. It's not for fucking even the progressive agenda. This is literally a vicious act of cultural violence. That V word, of course, is not appropriate, but we don't have another word for it. It's basically an aggressive act. It's, 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 um, it's hate speech <laughs> under the progressive terms. You could give me nice half Asian, there's some inclusion, Cassandra Kane, bad woman. You could give me hot Barbara Gordon, fuck it, Rhett Connor into a lesbian, all fucking, all ex whatever, I don't care. She's not, but f f oh, I can handle that, I guess. Probably almost nobody else would, but I'm trying to meet you halfway. Give her her own suit. Give her a sick motorcycle. Have any other shit you want. The fact that the proof, the undeniable proof that this is a vicious act of hatred that is deliberately seeking hate viewers, hate watchers, hate clickers, and it's tailor fucking made for a smorgasbord of the Mary Sue and we hunted the mammoth and fucking Jezebel and fucking Polygon and all this shit to write a bunch of articles about triggered man baby sexists who are homophobes to boot 
Let's just rack up that combo, combo, combo breaker. Yeah, fucking, yeah, we know. We know your game. You've been doing this for at least five years. Doing the same old shit. And even the normies are wise to it, folks. This is not going to fly. And believe me, you're going to be lacking in your general support. The only people who will be supporting you in these articles and shit and in their little blog posts are also the people who that even though you got Negasonic Teenage Bulldike literally terraforming Batman suit onto her like the parasite she is, like the parasite all feminists are, male and female, especially the males. The males are rapist parasites. Anyway, <laughs> I digress. It's not going to be watched by these people. They're not going to watch. Most of the people who are supporting you don't read comics, don't watch shows, and if they go to see some cape shit, they're going to go see Avengers. We're talking the kind of people who only see Avengers, not the intervening films, unless maybe it's Iron Man or some shit. Get the, or Black Panther, yeah, get the fuck out of here. Folks, this is going to bomb and it will be blamed on white men. You might as well say, Darren, you have single can, uh, excuse me, Darren, you have single handedly canceled Batman. <laughs> Bat women before it even airs. This is going to bomb, folks, big time. <laughs> like, yeah, get fucking wrecked. Not gonna happen. I don't even know how I talked about this for 12 minutes. It's just so fucking absurd. It's not gonna be viewed, it's not enough to participate. It has to be a vicious, hostile takeover where they don't just take your shit, but they spit on you for complaining. They laugh at you because you're helpless to stop these studio execs who just want to burn giant piles of money, wasting them on these pathetic vanity projects. This isn't even virtue signaling at this point. We are into pure, distilled essence of raw, naked, selfish, fucking vanity. This is this. It's this. It's all this. And the thing is, hey, bitch, if you want me to be okay with you doing this, jerk mine too, you fucking slut. Thanks for watching.